Hello. Today we are going to be going over the process of photosynthesis. Photon of light. This process starts with a photon of light. A specific wavelength. And it hits the chlorophyll. Step number two. The one photon of light causes the electron on this chlorophyll to spin out of orbit like this. Third, the chlorophyll must replace this electron. It's able because the thylakoid space is an aqueous environment and is filled abundantly with water molecules. Here's an example of one right here. The bombs are missing. The chlorophyll, after this, must replace this electron and is able to because the thylakoid space, as I shall note it, is filled with water. Step number four. The dissociation of water is when the chlorophyll grabs the electron from a water molecule. It's such a process, they'll grab it, just put it back up. That's how the process works. As Nathan was saying, photolysis occurs after the water molecule breaks apart. So this water molecule right here is going to break apart. But now, a concentration of protons or hydrogen ions, they're the same thing, begin to build up inside the thylakoid space. The electron is passed along the thylakoid membrane right up there to the cytochrome. Then, like I was saying before, more protons begin to build up in the thylakoid space. Because of the electron transfer along the thylakoid membrane right here and the photolysis, a chemismatic gradient really forms in the ATP synthase, which is actually right here. So we have a soft tube forming right there within it, and there is a transfer of the solute from the high concentration right through there into a low concentration really. So that's what's happening right there. And because of the thylakoid space is acidic, because of an excess of hydrogen ions, proteins are popped through the chemismatic gradient to a neutral environment. So that's actually what happens there. And finally, this whole process releases oxygen and phosphorylation of the ADP that we were talking about earlier, plus the P into ATP. So what you have is actually an ADP plus a P into an ATP, really. And that's the light-dependent reaction. Understand? Oh, God, I'm hungry. Yeah. Food. Nom, 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 nom. Hello, fratties, we got a new member. I may be a fat car, but you are something else.